Good morning from Onomichi, Japan. I had to think about where I was. It's early. Uh, it's about 10 to 6 in the morning and I am going to take the ferry. I've got my bike here and today I'm going to ride to Imabari. It's about 43 miles away so uh, take this bike here. I'll turn my camera around so you can see. And so that's the bike I picked up. It's, it's not bad. It's pretty lightweight. It looks like it's heavy, but it's not. Uh, and it's got, uh, it's got more gears than the last bike I had, and they weigh about the same. So I feel pretty good about riding this bike to uh, Imabari. Um, I'm just waiting for the ferry to come. You can see it over there across the, across the river there. Just waiting for that to come in. Uh, it starts at 6. And so... Uh, I, I'm hoping that I can I can ride this 43 mile ride uh, in about uh, six hours so that should put me there about noon and then uh, it gives me plenty of time to catch the bus back when you rent a bike from here when you rent one of these bikes from the, the local shop there, it's a thousand yen a day. That, that works out to a little less than 10 bucks a day. But the cool thing about it is you can ride it from here and drop it off at any point on all these little islands along the way. You can go all the way to Imabari, which is the end point. I think it's the end point. Uh, and just drop your bike off there at, at one of those locations. And, and then you can sign your paperwork, be done, and... Uh, ride the ride the bus back and that's what I plan to do so hopefully if I don't get a flat tire or anything I'll make Imabari uh, by about you know two-ish 12-ish to two-ish somewhere in there we'll see but uh, I'm gonna get after it because I've already I've already ridden about a third of this so uh, I'll get started and I'll take some video as I go let's do this thing Okay, it's bridge one. Wow, the wind is really blowing and right in my face, so <laughs> I'm hoping I can make it to Imabari, 40 plus miles away, uh, by two o'clock in the afternoon. So we'll see. Bridge number one. The sun is starting to come out. Yay! Ooh, that was a climb. I believe I'm sweating a little bit. So I made it to the top of the first bridge. I don't know if you can see how there it is. Beautiful up here. And look at that. Look at the tide. I don't know if you can see that, but man, that tide is ripping through there. Okay. can take a scooter across this bridge. Underneath. I don't think you can take it across on the highway above. Oh, and the wind is still in my face. I think you guys are probably hearing that wind noise. So I'm about, it's about 10 kilometers in, maybe a little more. Okay, carrying on. Okay, there's bridge number two of four. About 20 kilometers in now, maybe 25. This is about a third of the way, so making pretty good time even with the, with the wind blowing like it is. the Hakata Bridge. So I gotta go up and around this way to get over there to it. But yeah, that should be the last bridge before the really long one, the one that's uh, six and a half kilometers long. So I'm getting there. I think I got about uh, 25 kilometers to go, I think. Maybe a little less. We'll see. But yeah, getting there.
you look down there, this is the place you can go and you can swim with the dolphins. I saw this on the map. You can see them out there. See, I can see a couple of them out there. Do you see them? I can see them. Can you see them? Yeah, it's very beautiful here. Wow, and the weather is perfect. It's probably like 70, well, maybe 75 degrees. So nice. <laughs> Check that bridge out. 